Good morning, church. This is Pastor Kara Knudsen. It is Monday, June 29th, and this is our Faith Five. <sighs> Today I am <coughs> just grateful to uh, get up in the morning and feel happy and uh, just to feel good um, with everything that's been going on in our world lately. That has been a rare thing. So to wake up and to just feel happy is um, is very, very nice, and I enjoy that quite a bit. So today our scripture passage is from Psalms 119, verses 10 through 16. With my whole heart I seek you. Do not let me stray from your commandments. I treasure your word in my heart so that I might not sin against you. Blessed are you, O Lord. Teach me your statutes. With my lips I declare all the ordinances of your mouth. I delight in the way of your decrees as much as in all riches. I will meditate on your precepts and fix my eyes on your ways. I will delight in your statutes. I will not forget your word. You can hear a um, a love and a longing that the writer has to spend time in the presence of God, to study God's word, uh, and to, through that word, to encounter the mystery and the glory and the holiness of God. So allow yourself to experience your heart being warmed by God to experience for yourself firsthand the love and the glory that radiates from God and warms our very being. There's a, a deep longing within each of us that uh, one of the theologians, I can't remember their name, this is that there's a deep longing within each of us a God-shaped hole within each of us that only God can fill. And I think that's, you know, where we find true satisfaction and joy is just in knowing and spending time with our Creator. So today, let us pray that we may all know and experience God's love and joy for ourselves and that we might lead other people to experience that as well. Let's pray. Dear God, we thank you for this day. We thank you for the invitation you give to us each and every new day to spend time in your presence, to sit and bask in the warmth of your love. Be with us today. Help us to pause and to take time and space to meditate on your word. Martin Luther said that the Bible is the cradle of Jesus. It's the baby in the lap. So be with each of us today as we go about our day and our routines and our obligations and our work. And bless each and every one of us. Christ's name we pray. Amen. Well, this is going to be a short one today, but you are a beloved child of God, known, loved, claimed, and blessed. Amen.